Hey guys, Carnate here, and I know, I know, it's another short video, but this is just a random video I had on my hard drive that I decided I'd get out there for you guys, because really I haven't been putting up too much Black Ops 2 gameplay lately, and I apologize for that, I've actually been playing a lot of Black Ops 2 as of recent, so I'll try and get a few more gameplays out there for you guys, and if you don't mind, you could either sit and watch my other Black Ops 2 gameplays, or watch my Minecraft, or my Zombies, or whatever whatever else you want to do. So, basically, this short video, I have another little kind of elementary school stories thing I want to get into. I, I might just, like, make a whole series of, like, school stories and stuff like that, but, anyways, this one is, it's pretty much just me saying, be nice to your teachers. Like, try and f befriend your teachers, make friends with them, because believe me, it helps, honestly, like, I would make friends with pretty much all my teachers in elementary school, like, talk to them and, you know, just be a genuine nice guy, and it helped, because in the end, well, not in the end, but at some point in my elementary school career, there was, like, I did something wrong, I can't remember what it was, but I did something that I wasn't supposed to do, and then another kid, like, told the teacher on me, and then the teacher's like, oh, no, he's just joking, he's just having a laugh, and I'm just like, huh, well, this could work to my advantage if I just make friends with, like, all the teachers I have, and then they can never get me in trouble. Well, they might get me in trouble, obviously. They can still do it if I do something, like, extremely terrible, but if another kid's just being, like, a tattletale, just, well, tattletale, snitch, rather, either one, childish little terminology with tattletale, or rather a snitch, that, like, you could just befriend your teacher, and they'll just shake it off like it's nothing. They'll be like, oh, no, he wouldn't do something like that. That's not him. But with that being said, don't take advantage of your teachers, because obviously they will lose trust in you. You'll end up doing something completely wrong, and they'll just flip shit and not do anything like... They won't believe you, pretty much. Just like the little... What was it? The little boy who cried wolf or whatever, where like... There's that sheep, like a shepherd guy, and he just... That was a terrible stud by me again. I'm just watching this over again. But there's, like, a shepherd guy, and he just... Uh, what's it called? He'd say, oh, help, there's wolves coming, and then there never were. So then when there actually were wolves, no one would believe him. So that's pretty much what I'm getting at here is, like, don't overuse this. Don't just keep going over and over again to use this to your advantage. You have to, you have to lay off. You have to ration it out. Use this only for, like, the extreme cases. And on that note, there's also another thing. Like, there was my very first day of elementary school. I had a office report card, which in elementary school was, like, the worst thing you could get because you go to the office, they give you a, like, not a report card, but it's, like, it's a conduct report where you do something wrong and then they send it home to your parents. Your parents have to sign it and you have to say, oh, I know what I did wrong and everything like that. It was pretty terrible. Like, first day of school, they didn't have a playground at the new school because the first day of the school was ever out, obviously. So, me and my friend, well, not even my friend, just some random kid in my class, they just threw all the kids in the teacher's parking lot. So, me and this kid in my class decided it would be a good idea to start picking up stones and chucking them across the street because, obviously, if you haven't thrown rocks at something in your childhood, you had a bad childhood. There has to be some point in your childhood where you decided hey, let's pick up this rock and see if I can hit that thing. And just, like, chuck it at some random shit. So, that's what we did. We ended up doing that, and there happened to be a target across the street, which was the, uh, the pickup of a truck, or, like, the cab, the back part of a truck. So we're like, oh, let's see if we can get the rocks in there. So we start doing that, and then, apparently the teachers, like, got scared or something that, apparently there was a teacher's car, too. So, be sure to not throw rocks at your teacher's car, because that's just bad. But, yeah, we got a conduct report, and... That was pretty shitty, but this is the end of the video, guys, so if you enjoyed the video, be sure to leave a like. If you want to, be sure to subscribe for more, and follow me on Twitter with the link in the description. So I'll see you guys some other time for more videos. I've been Cardate, and peace out.